welcome back to my channel you guys I'm Hannah and this is so much to sign with Hannah I'm back in London you guys so what does that mean that means a new shopping vlog for you guys and of course it's Christmas time well almost so lots of London Christmas lights and uh, I love Christmas lights I hope you do too so we'll put some of those in and I'm off to Liberty and they have got a lot of Christmas going on I went there last year and I think you enjoyed it back then and um, maybe we'll find a little something for you guys just like I did last Christmas introducing the beautiful Liberty London store the architecture is second to none you guys I really do think that Liberty is one of the most prettiest stores, well, in the UK, well, maybe in the world even. And here, yeah, the windows are looking really quite nice. A little tent with goodies in it. Yeah, let's check out the other window. So they obviously have got their Christmas decorations, beautiful pillows. They have the best pillows, guys. Absolutely. Uh, and yeah, more homeware. Okay, well, time to head in, I think. We are in Liberty, you guys, and here is the Liberty's Christmas decorations. Giant globe. And little stars. Let's see what bags they have. I like this dress from Norton Tote. The flower decoration on it is very pretty. It looks quite roomy too. Couldn't see the price, unfortunately. And then there are some smaller bags. This black one is quite lovely. And the gold one. Oh, hello. <laughs> That's quite nice. That's a nice little gift idea. Liberty Beauty perfume. Yeah. Very pretty with the Liberty textile design. Loewe, loewe, loewe. Yeah, I'm still pondering the puzzle bag. This blue colour is right up my street. Also thought about grey, but I prefer this leather, the smooth leather. Yeah, it's nicer and the strap is gorgeous. And then they have this purple version. It's a lovely deep purple actually from that kind of satin color. Nice. What I really did want to see was the Suna Fujita collaboration. It looks so beautiful on the website. I'm just putting some images here. Love the penguin, love the panda, but they didn't have it. So I will have to go to another store. If you love flower design and printed textiles with the most intricate flower patterns, Liberty is the top place to go. And look at this cute little iPod case. Very cute. Yeah, like the colour of that. Uh, let's see, what is the price? If I can get it out, what does that say? 85 maybe something like that yeah beautiful uh, so they've got all these different colorways the blue the greens the pinks and this kind of multicolor print what do you guys think what do you prefer personally i think i prefer this one it's nice and bright and easy to spot 
There's also this more kind of graphic print with uh, the Liberty lettering as the design and with stripes. Yeah, a bit more kind of classic, I guess. And if you're not into flowers, that might be an option. Loving this little pouch. It's kind of a silky pouch. Good price as well. If you're ever stuck for a gift, Liberty is a great place to go. Look at these lovely little card holders. Just delicious. And here's one of their tote bags. This is the green variation. Yeah, very nice. Love the pattern. And the blue with the brown, the same pattern. Oh, the chain here. I think this is a new little crossbody bag. Haven't seen that before. That's quite cool. And an all black leather version in the same pattern again. Very nice, you guys. And I've got a bit of a burgundy thing going on. This tote bag is lovely too. What was your favourite? Isabel Moran doing a little bit of a sparkly number and some more suede bags. Bit of J.W. Anderson, you guys. I love the detail on this one. This is beautiful. And I actually like how it's two colors. A tote bag. She's got that detail on it. Similar colour. Comes in this one. It's like it looks like laces almost. Can you see that? Do you think J.W. Anderson is one of the most creative designers around? I really like these. Yeah, of course, um, J.W. Anderson also recently won the International Designer of the Year Award in New York. So he's doing something right with his own brand here and Loewe, that's for sure. And I absolutely really love both actually. The leather is lovely on this. Marcel Magella. Let's go upstairs and have a look what they have on the other floors. Any Lego lovers out there? Lego, Lego. Liberty London made of Lego. <laughs> incredible. Absolutely incredible. Absolutely love it, you guys. Let's head into the Christmas shop. It may be very busy, so I'll do my best to get some footage for you.
Oh, I do like a good nutcracker. I've got them in many different sizes to decorate at home. Hmm, do I need another one? What a silly question. Maybe I do. Or maybe I need this heart. Look at this, isn't that lovely? With the Liberty building on the front. Very nice. Okay, I found the serious stuff, you guys. Handbags. Handbags with a dog in them. Oh, my lord. Yeah, another, another dog in a handbag. Oh, goodness me. Seriously, if you need Christmas ornaments, Liberty have got a really great selection. Some really fun things to put on your Christmas tree. What do we have here? The Queen's handbag with the sandwich from the Paddington Bear sketch for the Jubilee. This has to be my favourite. Oh, snow globes. Are you as big a fan of snow globes as I am? I just can't resist giving them a good little shake when I see them in store. And I've got a few at home and yeah, shake them all the time. They had these Hello Kitty ornaments uh, last year as well. They've got some new designs, reindeer, what else do we have, a little painter guy, yeah they're very cute. I hope you enjoyed the little Christmas shop footage, it was very busy in there so a bit limited but I did buy something for you guys, what do you think it was, let me know in the comments below. Liberties do the most beautiful cushions. I just love their cushions. Can a woman have too many cushions? I wonder. Hmm. Then I'm in danger, I tell you that. <laughs> I think my husband would go berserk if I bought another cushion, but look at this blue. Love it! London again but it's quite mild though I think I put on too much, many clothes uh, because it was quite cold during the week but it's milder today actually I'm at Fenwick now so maybe I should just take a peek what do you think let's do it I'm really only interested in checking out Fenwick's uh, vintage bags Prada camera bag Another little nylon Prada bag. Oh, a Mama, I think it's Mama Fendi Baguette, this one. I quite like the size of this. Uh, £1,400? Hmm, I think that's a bit expensive for that, to be honest. 
And we've got a Louis Vuitton. Don't know what this one is called, but it's quite a nice condition, about 1800 pounds. Mm, not so sure. And we've got a bit of Gucci and Alma. Can't see the price on that. Then we've got some Chanel. Yeah, Chanel is always very expensive um, in Fennec, I find, in the vintage. I think if I'm going to buy anything like this, it will have to be online. <laughs> yeah, I think the prices are just a little bit high. Uh, yeah, I like this red little number. That's cute. Look at the gold against the red. That's nice. The Diana bag. Yeah, I think this is one of my favourite, to be honest, from Chanel. I really like that, but um, I think it was about £10,000. This one didn't get the price on. It's got quite a bit of uh, colour transfer. And then we've got the Lady Dior. Yeah, it's, it's nice, but it's not a colour that I would pick. £4,600, again, quite a lot. Let's finish up with a few little Christmas lights from London Town. And here's Piccadilly and the lovely, lovely Regent Street. The angels are back. Look how stunning they are. Thank you so much for watching you guys. I hope you enjoyed this little shopping vlog from Liberty London and London Town. If you did, please give it some thumbs up love and take a moment to subscribe too if you haven't already. It would mean the world to me. Thank you for all of your support. It means the world. Have a most fabulous day wherever you are in the world. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.